Howdy. Welcome to Christian Labor. My name is Shane. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, as well as clicking on any ads that you may see that you like. Uh, that's the only way I'm earning any money for this. Uh, the purpose of the channel is to talk about things that don't get a lot of airplay in America. Issues to do with Christianity and the economy. Uh, our faith actually has a lot to say about egalitarianism. Help for the poor. There's a, a lot of talk about small government conservatives, but not a lot of talk about how the government got so huge and what that has to do with greed and corruption which is, of course, precisely the kind of thing Christians ought to address, but increasingly do not. Julian the Apostate, which was the last pagan emperor of Rome, once famously complained that pagans were being drawn away from their faith by the generosity of Christians, who were drawing the pagans away as children are drawing, he said, <laughs> with cakes. Uh, these days, not so much. Uh, go to any church in the USA, which you're likely to see is a handful of well-to-do folks running an organization that's largely aimed at specific political agendas. Some of them are for government programs, some of them are against government programs, but what they do not do a lot of is direct financial outreach uh, to alleviate suffering and poverty. There's a lot of judgment, there's a lot of rhetoric, there's not a lot of direct giving. I've been to churches where literally hundreds of thousands of dollars are spent sending people to parts of the world where I'm told uh, they've never heard the gospel. Um, as I've read about these areas, I find out they have heard about the gospel and they don't like it. Uh, we do have brothers and sisters there. We do owe it to folks to go into these areas. But I'm increasingly convinced that we're sending way too many preachers and not enough people to physically help or even extract people from these regions, the Middle East in particular, to save their lives. Um, and in the meantime, Christianity shrinks here in the West because it's associated with greed. There's, there's no excuse for Christianity being associated with greed. No contest of charity should ever be lost by Christians, no matter how desperately soft-headed it may seem to you, because our example is Christ, who gave his life while we were yet sinners to save us from ourselves, and we're called to do the same for others. Um, I'm not here to change the teachings of Christ either. It's not a liberal theology channel. Um, I'm here to support a worldview that has taken a nosedive in my lifetime. A worldview that says that we do best when we do good, and that we should do good, not just for ourselves, but for our fellow man. So with that in mind, please enjoy the channel. Again, like, subscribe, comment, and click on an ad or two, would you? Thanks.